The Humboldt current with its upwelling system at the coast of Peru is, in terms of fishing catches, the most productive system in the world. Aside from anchovy and other fishery resources, it is home to many differing species, forming an abundant food web. Food webs change over time. For example, marine animals can appear or disappear from ecosystems, depending on living conditions shaped by temperature, oxygen or other factors. To understand these changes, scientists monitor ocean conditions and analyze a lot of different data. This enables them to simulate a variety of future scenarios on their computer. One example. Anchovies are small fish. They are a common food source for marine mammals, seabirds and larger fish. To survive, anchovies need to feed on very small crustaceans. At the same time, they have to constantly hide from predators. Off the coast, in greater depth, are water masses that contain very little oxygen. This type of zone in the water is called an oxygen minimum zone. If there is no oxygen to breathe, anchovies, which require a certain amount of oxygen in their environment, cannot neither feed nor hide in this zone and therefore must stay outside of it. In the future, the water in the Humboldt current may become further deoxygenated due to factors such as rising water temperatures and reduced coastal winds along the shore. Near the coast, the oxygen minimum zone may expand and come closer to the surface. If this happens, the anchovies will not be able to find enough food and will have to migrate further south. This will, of course, have consequences. If anchovies disappear from the Humboldt system, many marine animals, including many other fish species, will lose one of their main food sources. This development would lead to less fish for artisanal fishers who fish nearer to the shore. Only large fishing boats can go far enough out to find the fish who will have migrated due to an expanded oxygen minimum zone. What can be done if the oxygen levels in the water of Peru's coast fall too low for anchovies to thrive? On the open sea, anchovies still have predators, for example the bonito, the tuna and the mahi-mahi. So instead of the anchovy, one might be able to catch these warm water fish species that are favored by warmer climate condition. Scientists want to understand the changes in marine ecosystems, which the future will bring. They are testing these future scenarios not in the actual ocean, but with computer models. These models can be used to simulate the mentioned changes and can help in developing suitable adaptation measures. This way, scientists can work hand-in-hand -hand with local fishers, communities and other professionals to help protect and sustainably use the ecosystem in the future.